Hey, this is Chris and Lamb of God. You're watching Rock and Metal News. Hey guys, this is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News, and this is your Maximum Threshold Rock and Metal News report. Kill Devil Hill, the band that includes ex Pantera and Black Sabbath members, are streaming their new song, Where Angels Dare to Roam, at noisecreep.com. You can check it out. Their second album, Revolution Rise, is out on October the 29th through Century Media Records. Check out a 30-second teaser from the making of Metalocalypse, the Doomstar Requiem, a clock opera, online at craveonline.com. The TV special will be played on October the 27th. And Slayer stated they are doing an old-school Slayer night set on their upcoming North American tour. The set will include songs from Show No Mercy, Hell Awaits, Rain and Blood, South of Heaven, and Seasons in the Abyss. Uh, and they stated the final set list is still coming together, but we're going to give the fans what amounts to decades of aggression. It's going to be a great night of music and moshing for everyone, stated Tom. And Winds of Plague have released a new song from their new album, Resistance. The track is called Sewer Mouth, and it, will, uh, it is now streaming on YouTube. The track features guest vocals from Vincent Bennett of the Acacia Strain. The new album will be out on October the 29th through Century Media Records. And Tool's webmaster has added an update at toolband.com as he listened to material that Tool are currently working on. A portion of the comments stated... A couple of weeks ago, I visited the Tool Loft to try and get some kind of ideas as to how things were progressing with the writing sessions. It says, I'm happy to report that there has indeed been a lot of progress as far as new material goes, especially with the lengthy so-called epic piece that the guys have been arranging for quite some time now. It features complex time signatures, interesting harmonic structure, and expanding effects processing. It says, I'm not suggesting any way in any way that the band is ready to go into the studio anytime soon. And continuing with your MaximumThreshold.net rock and metal news, Clutch will release Earth Rocker Live on November the 26th, which is a double vinyl picture disc. The set is a vinyl release of the Earth Rocker album with a second LP featuring each song live in the same order. Sepultura's new album, The Mediator Between Head and Hands Must Be the Heart, is now streaming for a limited time in its entirety. The new album is out on October the 29th and is streaming at metalhammer.co.uk. Killer Be Killed, the new band featuring Soulfly's Max Cavalera, the Dillinger Escape Plan's Greg, Mastodon's Troy, and ex-The Mars Volta drummer Dave Elich, will be out in 2014. It was stated in the press release that Max, Troy, and Greg will all contribute vocals on the album, and Greg also playing guitar. It's a bit of Sabbathy doom, a bit of thrash, a bit of hardcore and punk, Greg stated. Can't wait for that one. And Halloween vocalist Andy Darris and his new project, Andy Darris and the Bad Bankers. Uh, they, release, they are releasing a new album titled Million Dollar Haircuts on Ten Cent Heads, and it will be released on November 22nd. The first track, Don't Listen to the Radio, is now streaming on YouTube, so you can go and check that out. This is Ron from YouTube's Rock and Metal News with a Z, and this has been your Maximum Threshold Rock and Metal News Report. Thanks for tuning in.